Sai here, and welcome to the segment of Sai's Corner called Life in the Works. As you remember, I made that goal board since I turned 45, and I'm going to update you on how I'm doing on the goals. This morning, while reading the Bible, which is on my goal list, I came across Matthew 23, 23, and it's Jesus talking, and he is talking to the Pharisees, who were the teachers of the law, and he was kind of reprimanding them. Actually, he was reprimanding them, because he's saying how terrible for you, because you, you, you teach this, but you do this, and blah, 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 blah. And verse 23, he says, but you don't obey the, the really important teachings of the law, justice, mercy, and being loyal. And that word, it's like, hmm, being loyal. My scheduled reading of the day also took me to Psalm 18. And in Psalm 18, 25, it's David. And he says, Lord, you are loyal to those who are, are loyal. There was loyalty again. I was like, hmm, loyalty. I, in my mind, I know what loyalty means, but I looked it up on dictionary.com. And this is what dictionary.com says. It says, faithful adherence to a sovereign, comma, government, comma, leader, comma, cause, etc. And also faithfulness, faithfulness to commitments. Faithfulness to commitments made me think about my goals. And that is why I am here with you today. Since I told you I'd be keeping you updated on my goals, I'm gonna share one of my goals with you. And that goal is, my board out. Publish two books per year while living in Louisiana. Well, we have been living in Louisiana for one year now, and I have two books published. This one is called Discovering God's Secrets. It is a book about a person that discovers how real God is and the teachings that God has that tells you how to get closer to him. David talked about loyalty to God and how God is loyal to those who are loyal. So with this book, I'm hoping by reading the story and you see how this woman learns the teachings of God in the Bible and how she applies it to her life. Just a, in an easier way to put into practice the loyalty that's taught in the Bible. Jesus told the Pharisees that they were teaching, but that they that they weren't obeying. And so that means they weren't living their life how they're supposed to. God tells us how to live and that we're not supposed to do it our way. We're not supposed to lean on our own understanding, but we're supposed to lean on his. So I have a book called How to Lean, and that's basically just that. It's taking everyday stuff and saying what God says on how to lean on him with it. And this volume one is about words. So I'm hoping, since I'm supposed to write two books a year, by the, the, the whole time that we live in Louisiana, we might be here 10 years or 10 years total, nine more years, maybe five years. I don't know. Anyway, multiply that by two. That's quite a few volumes. So that's my goal and my commitment to write those books. So hopefully my loyalty to my commitment of writing these books will also be a commitment to God and share with other people things that, his, that, that the Bible is telling us on how to lean on him or how to be loyal to him. I'm hoping to share and do 